All right, everyone, this is another philosophical theory. Dogs are humans. Yes, dogs are humans. We are all related by DNA. They have a brain. They have livers. They have hearts. They have organs, body parts. They have feet, skin, hair. They're just like us. They just look a little bit different. They also talk, too. We speak English. They just bark. But they are humans. They have their own personality, and they deserve to be treated like humans, which means they deserve to have rights. So if you hit that dog, in my opinion, that's child abuse. And if you kill a dog, either accidentally or on purpose, then that's murder. Then you yourself need to be put down and held accountable for your moral crimes against God's creation. Dogs are man's best friend. They need to be protected like a kid. Most humans are stopping, they, they have stopped giving birth to humans. They are adopting animals. I had a dog. I enjoyed my time with him. Fortunately, he moved on. And that is what the American public is going to realize. There ain't been a dog. He's going to be cute. He's going to be cuddly. But then he's going to get old. He's going to act like a baby human being. And they might love that or they might hate that. But the dog's going to win at the end of the day. Eventually, the dog's going to pass on, and he's going to move to paradise. He's going to be with the Lord, and the dog's going to be perfect and await for his owner in heaven. That's where Spike the dog is. He is now in paradise, and he will wait me when heaven comes to me. So dogs are humans. Respect your dog. Trust it. The dog might not be perfect, but he is one of the Lord's creations. So yes, dogs are officially humans. Some humans are dogs. If you believe in evolution, it just goes backwards. It just goes backwards. So if you're a dog, you're going to lose to a human every time. Everyone needs to understand that humans are made in the image of God. Same thing with cats, dogs, leopards, anything living is made in the image of God. We are all living beings. We have DNA. This traces back to a single progenitor, which is what I call God. So what does this mean? It means the Father and I are one. We are connected. It means Elohim. It means Christianity is a dualistic religion. You have Yahweh. He's the Father. Yehoshua, also known as Jesus, he's the Son. And then you have the Holy Spirit, which lies in all of us. Some of our Holy Spirits are corrupted, and some of our Holy Spirits are still pure. How do you know your Holy Spirit is corrupted? Either you're missing your son or you're missing a dog. That's the only way. This is my philosophical theory that dogs are humans.